Hey guys, welcome back to Corsetta Nursing. If you've had trouble with stroke assessments or understanding what the heck you're even doing with those neurological tests, we're gonna go ahead and show you today in an NIH stroke scale assessment video with the virtual reality nursing simulation. Let's get right into it. Knock, knock. Hi, Mr. Williams. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. My name is Will. I'm going to be your nurse today. So I came in here to do a quick neuro check on you. Is that okay with you? Sure. Okay. So how are you feeling overall? I'm feeling a little nauseous, but I think that's just because of the medicine they gave me last night. Okay. All right. Well, we'll take a look at, we'll keep an eye on that and everything. Do you need any medication for it right now? No, I don't think so. It's just a mild headache. Okay, so you have a headache, so on a scale of 1 to 10, how bad is the headache? Maybe a 3. Okay, and what does it feel like? It's just a dull ache. Okay, and is there any specific spot that's located on your head? It's all over my head. Okay, and then when did you first notice it? I woke up with it this morning. Okay. All right, we'll keep an eye on it. Do you want any medication for your pain? No, not right now. Okay. So I'm going to first start out with doing your neuro check. I'm going to ask you some silly questions. We're going to get you on the monitor here real quick. So I am going to take your gown off. Do you have any questions for me before we get started here? No. My name is Robert Williams, and my date of birth is March 18th, 1958. Okay. And do you know where you are right now? Yes, I'm in the hospital. Do you know why you're at the hospital? Yes, I'm here because you said I had a bleed in my head. Okay. And do you know what year it is right now? It's 2010. I think it's 2010. No, it's 2024, but I'm not surprised you're a little confused. Are you feeling a little confused? Yeah. Okay, do you remember what happened that led you to come to the hospital? No. Okay. All right, well, I know we just recently did a CT head, too. So has a doctor come in to talk to you about those results yet? No, they haven't. necessarily in the scope of able to do that for you, but I can go ahead and tell you the difference between a ischemic stroke and a hemorrhagic stroke. Do you know the difference already? No. Okay, so an ischemic stroke is when there is a clot or a thrombus that's blocking blood flow to reach your brain tissue, and it causes damage that way. And then there's a hemorrhagic stroke that is an actual bleed that leaks into your brain tissue causing direct damage. Okay. All right, can you go ahead and repeat what I just taught you? Sure. A scheme stroke is when there's a clot or thrombus blocking blood flow to reach the brain tissue, and hemorrhagic stroke is when there's an actual bleed that leaks into the brain tissue causing direct damage. Very good. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get started here with your neuro check. So the first test I want you to do is smile for me. Okay, can you go ahead and stick out your tongue? Sure. Can you raise your eyebrows? I don't have my glasses on, but I can try. Can you go ahead and close your eyes? Okay. All right, good. So let's go ahead and check your eyes out. Are you having any vision changes or anything like that? Yeah. It feels like my left side vision is off. I'm not sure if I can even see anything to my left. Okay. Can you 
go ahead and follow my finger with your eyes. I see your finger and I'll follow it. Next test we're gonna do is I'm gonna see how much you can actually see. So you, can you go ahead and tell me when you see my hands flashing? Okay. I can see that. Okay, it does look like your left side vision is off, huh? Okay, so when you said your left side vision is off, does it is it completely gone or do you feel like it's just blurry? It feels blurry. Okay. It's like I can see things, but... Go ahead. Sorry, I interrupted you. No problem. I was going to say that I can see light and dark, but not much else. Okay. All right. Can you go ahead and touch your nose and then touch my finger? Okay. All right, so we're going to do a couple strength tests. So I'm going to have you lift up your left arm for me. Okay. Okay, can you lift up your left leg? Okay. Okay, can you lift up your right leg? Okay. All right, can you lift up your right arm? Okay. Heel to shin test, so can you rub your heels against your shin? Okay. okay. Good job. So can you go ahead and push down against my hands like a gas pedal? Okay. I'm going to try to stand up. No, don't do that. I just want you to push down like a gas pedal with your feet. Okay, good. Can you go ahead and squeeze my hand? Good. Go ahead and squeeze my hand over here. So your left side is feeling pretty weak over there? Yeah, it feels weak. Okay, I can tell. All right. It just feels like my left side vision is off. I'm not sure if I can even see anything to my left. Okay. All right, well, we have a couple more tests here. I have this clipboard here. There's all kinds of different tests on here. I'm gonna go ahead and hand it to you. Okay. So I, Got it? So I want you to go ahead and tell me what those objects are. Okay. Yeah, I can see a glove, a key, a feather, a cactus, a chair, and a hammock. Good. Can you say those words starting with mama? Okay. Mama. Tip top. 50-50. Thanks. Huckleberry. Baseball player. Say those sentences starting with you know how. Okay. You know how down to earth. I got home from work near the table in the dining room. They heard him speak on the radio last night. All right. And what is that scenario right here on the clipboard? Okay. All right. So 
I see a boy falling down a stool while trying to grab something from the cupboard. There's also a woman washing the dishes, but the sink is flooded. Very good. All right, you're doing good so far. Do you feel like you're having any trouble speaking? No, I don't. Okay, I feel like I'm talking just... Sorry about that. What were you saying? I said I feel like I'm talking just fine. Okay. And have you noticed any issues swallowing or anything like that? No. Okay, we'll have a speech therapist come in and see you, okay? Just to make sure you're swallowing, okay? Right now you're MPO, which means nothing by mouth, so we're not going to give you anything that you can drink or eat for right now, just to make sure you're not going to aspirate anything that you try to take, okay? Okay. All right, so that pretty much said, that's pretty much everything with the neuro check. The only, la the only thing I have left to do is that we're going to do a couple pinching and see if you can feel everything you're supposed to, okay? Okay. So I'm going to start with your face. I'm going to get, do a light pinch here. All right, you tell me if you can feel this, okay? Okay. Ouch. Ouch. I felt that. Ouch! That hurt. That hurt. Right, good. Hey guys, first of all, thank you so much for watching the video entirely through. It makes our day if we know that nursing school got a little bit easier after watching one of our videos. If you guys like this video, make sure you like it, subscribe to the channel for more, and drop down in the comments for any more ideas that you need help with nursing school. If you want to contact me personally, it's 940-218-4062. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next video.